rise and elite and all of that good stuff, man. We didn't get a chance to really talk about that, but we want to know where you guys are going. I am going to rise. Let me show y'all. We got the whole thing up here. Uh, I'm going to rise because number one, y'all already saw me say shakedown is there. And number two, like if you look at the stats, you look at the stuff that you get, elite does look tempting from the on the on the surface, but rise looks tempting when once. So I'm gonna read both of them. Come on. Good morning out there, 2K land, man. Y'all already know how we start this thing off with the Nodi Gang Wall of Fame, bro. Hey, this is my guy right here, Jay Nail. On, oh, I got your shirt, break, big dog. I got it. Hey, he he already say gym stars. Hey, he said I'm definitely riding with Shake. You know we already talking about yes sir, 17, all that. And one of the best comments from yesterday. You know we're doing, we did the video on the city trail and all that. If you didn't see that, go back and check that out, man. But my guy, hey, Astro B, he's the Astro Boy says, hey, listen, man, it's the same whack hairstyles, same plain jewelry, same type of clothes, same old hairstyles, which they did have some new hairstyles. They got the dreads pulled back in the bun or what have you, like, like me, that's what I'm gonna be rocking. Let me know what hairstyle you gonna be rocking. Same old hairstyles, same old copy and paste tattoos. The aesthetics are all the same, was hoping to see to see new and different stuff like change actual pendants iced out watches real life and different dreadlock hairstyles which they did have those they just you know they might they might have more they just didn't show them there they said new art tattoos different types of clothing uh than last year cars that we can drive and houses we could buy and buy uh but instead nothing changed Jesus Christ, bro. Hey, man, listen, man. This is It's a basketball game, my boy. So, like, like all that other stuff, you know, it, it, it's cool. But, but uh, you know, it is what it is. Also, I wanted to, uh, I wanted to uh, talk about, hey, Mr. King. Hey, he says, man, hey, I don't know who you have to in your thumbnails. But, man, that's your boy and uh, and AI. And, uh, let's, and then last but not least, man, hey, he says, hey, it's lit as an MF dog and uh, you the only YouTube I got to know this on for. Appreciate that, Mr. Adams, man. But yeah, I'm doing my own thumbnails right now, and I'm using, uh, I use AI art uh, to, to help me with that because I, I can't pay nobody to do that. But man, this house, well, this house knows like 3,800 a month. Boy, it's ridiculous, boy. But hey, it, that ain't what we're here to talk about, man. What we're here to talk about is the trailer yesterday. It was dope, man. It was, um like I said, I wouldn't expect to see so many different things from that. Uh, or or a whole lot of different things just because they're not going to show you too much in the trailer when we get the game You know, we'll see but it's a basketball game, baby So I, I say take it easy on them, man, but look all right also Moving right along. We got this from uh, Lily. She tweeted out a couple of things yesterday And we're gonna talk about this real quick man. She said listen the app is out uh, you know, iOS, this is the 2K app. I downloaded it already, the 2K companion app. The only thing that you can look at, I think some people were thinking it's a VC transfer because I had got a tweet saying, wait, my VC transfers. The only thing that you can see is NBA 2K23. I went into the app, you cannot see 24 yet. So your VC does not transfer that we know of yet. I wish it did, I hope it did. But at that we know of, the VC does not transfer transfer uh you know hey and before we get started with the rest of the stuff man make sure y'all like the video comment y'all thoughts down below man it would be dope if 2k did allow our vc to transfer but as of right now i uh, it, it, it just don't seem like that is the case and one thing that we forgot to do if y'all already know the intro said with your boy yes sir what's going on everybody it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's town coming to you live with another video now listen man look we were talking about on yesterday um we were talking about the rise in elite and all of that good stuff man we didn't get a chance to really talk about that but we want to know where you guys are going i am going to rise let me show y'all we got the whole thing up here uh i'm going to rise because number one y'all already saw me say shakedown is there and number two like if you look at the stats you look at the stuff that you get elite does look tempting from the on the on the surface but rise looks tempting when once so i'm gonna read both of them and it just says elevate your game and and, and earn unique rewards uh toward finishing playmaking dishing uh to the open man and all that good stuff so the brand new heat check gameplay boost uh get rewarded for the hot hand from the perimeter after knocking down some outside shots after uh, after i mean and even hotter 
hand, you know, after you hit some more shots or whatever like that. So like, to me, that's a shooting boost. It's just an active shooting boost where you're gonna have to work in order to get that shooting boost, man. So, and this and it appears to be kind of unlimited. So my guy gonna have maxed out defense anyway, so I'm not gonna need no more defense. My, my joint gonna be maxed out to the gills. So um, up next, then you got the finishing boost, earn a permanent boost to your finishing. Y'all know I'm trash at finishing, so I'm definitely going to be needing that. Uh, you'll be rising above the defense in no time, last but not least, the playmaking boost. Earn a permanent boost to your playmaking attributes. Um, your bag has never been deeper. That's why I'm going over there because because you know we get the shooting boost but it's just an active shooting boost i gotta start hitting shots before i get that shooting boost so you know it, it is what it is on elite however like I, like i said you still get some very good stuff over there you get the permanent uh boost you know the permanent defensive boost they hadn't quantified these and they have not told us the most important thing whether it'll be like let's say if it's plus five can i and let's say it's plus five and i need uh and i need 99 rebounding to do something right so if i have it will this give me plus five on my rebounding and then i can unlock badges or is this just something that's in the background if it's in the background it's not important if it's in the foreground it's very important so like let's say if i get an 81 dunk and it gives me plus five on my finishing because i chose rise will i be able to get contact dunks then these things are very important we don't know those yet so hey we'll we'll see how that goes man hey uh shooting boost earn permanent shooting up uh, boost on your shooting attributes greens by any means and last but not least this is the one that seems the most attractive is there the brand new two-way gameplay mechanic uh like i said i'm gonna have my shooting i'm gonna have my defense this is kind of what intrigued me a little bit and it says uh make a big play on one end of the floor and earn yourself a boost for the next possession going the other way the ultimate two-way player and i think that that's cool and it sounds good but in, in actuality how that's gonna play out man is most of the time when you when you make a play on the other floor what am i gonna get a steal i'm gonna get a block i'm gonna get something like that right and uh you got to get that ball to your point guard and and let him run with it or something like that if i get a steal i just kick it out the brook very and, and he goes and dunks the ball very rarely is it gonna be like okay i got a steal now we're gonna walk it up the court and try to find a way to get me into the game like that's just not gonna happen even or uh, maybe for the center that that, that that'll be kind of important because you throw it up to the center I like the center might get a block and then he's trailing up the court and now they don't even see him he gets a shot but for me and my position it's not gonna be so i'm i'm gonna go with the hot hand heat check you know and all that good stuff and, and we're gonna see how that goes man that's that's what i'll be going with also taking the pause for the cause man get your tees in the breeze when you're rocking with breeze tees make sure you like the video man we got this stuff out here man you can get your own custom shirt shirts and all of that stuff check out the site Link is in the description. We got stuff for the females. We got stuff for the, uh, you know, working out, lockdown, university, all that stuff, man. So make sure y'all check that that site out. Uh, link is down in the description, man. But hey, up next, and I think this is really all I got for y'all, last but not least, man. It's a, it's a little video. I had tweeted this out and I said, I thought this was, I thought this was a pretty common knowledge, especially after last year, uh, the way the, the way that the play tested version was described to us was totally different in the game. And what I'm saying is, let, we're gonna listen to what an, um, what this what uh, they were saying in the space last night, and then we'll talk about it. And I'm gonna let y'all get up out of here, man. I just have a quick question. Uh, do you think it's kind of embarrassing how many like in game mistakes you could had at uh, Community Day, like uh, Giannis having uh, Damian Lillard's speed, or uh, no, or, I don't because or that and the game... Clay Thompson thing. So, so the the reason that I'm not embarrassed by those mistakes, they literally that was not 2K24 what we played in there. there yeah, was, but they that was that they... was a game that they just threw together for us to create content on and have an impact. That that was mainly for the builder. We're Wait, lucky so, we even got gameplay like that. So, so I have bro. a question: When you loaded, what? when the game was loaded up in the main menu, I just have... and so right there we gonna act like we surprised, man. But like I said, though, I I I was actually. I, I spoke with people that play tested, like 2K did two play tests last year or what have you. And I spoke with people that were involved in both of the play tests and they were in the game that was described to me during the first play test and then the second play test, which was community day, totally different than what we got. Much closer to what we're getting with 2K24, but it still was way different than what it was. And so I, th I thought this, uh, this is very common for gaming companies. A lot of people don't understand what they're talking about. They just be out here talking, but, and, and, and fake outrage and stuff like that. But this is very common for a gaming company because they don't want to reveal too much or what have you. They will go, they'll go in and create a build 
of the game, uh, and, and you know, the, you may, it might call it an alpha. It's not an alpha. It's not a beta. It's not a demo. It's not any of that. It's just a build of the game and what they call thrown together build of the game or what have you. They just set up a, a build of the game with several different elements, or they might they might um they may tighten up a build of the game, a pre-alpha or something like that, and then they let you play it make content on it and do all of that stuff like that it seems to me just like 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 with Giannis you know they, it's almost like they wanted people to play the game with Giannis with all those moves so they could feel like yeah Giannis is really out here getting busy and then like you said shoot when it comes back that's not what's going on at all so that's very common in gaming they don't want you they, they know people gonna do stuff like the leak that's why they weren't really tripping about the leak or whatever they don't want people to you know do stuff like the leaks and all that so if you leak it it's not a big deal because it's not the final version of the game they never play the final version of the game and it just it just never has been the case it, it just, just is what it is thought it was common knowledge hey fake outrage and all that stuff man it is what it is but i think we all know that and like i said if you spoke to anybody that came back that game that they played at, at community day last year much slower no sigs no moves couldn't get open all that stuff you was losing adrenaline if you even looked at the looked at the turbo but it was a way different game so the game that we're going to be getting the complete the gold version of the game the polished version it's gonna be way different than that, and, and we'll see how that is, man. So it's much to do about nothing. It's just one of those things where we don't give you too much, so you can't give anything away. And if you do give something away, it's not gonna re it's not gonna really be the be the same. That's why they even told them that I, I thought it was I thought that we would know that after they said, hey, the um the the stats in the builder that you guys had to work with, those were not the stats, and then they gave us the stats the other day. So, like I said, I thought that we would be able to end first and say everybody think they're so smart and all of that stuff, And but now we want to do fake outrage and stuff like that. But if you're that smart to know that they changed so much afterwards, then you would think you would be intuitive enough to say, oh, well, you know, this is not, this couldn't possibly be the final game because they have some different caps and stuff like, but hey, it is what it is, man. They just said 50% of us don't think and 40% and is just faking and 10 is just idiots. So it is what it is, man. Hey, like I said, man, when you want to look at something and you always, if you want to see who the fakest person in the room is, look at the person that's pounding their chest saying that they the realest and then that's probably who's going to be the fakest person around, man. So, hey, that's how I go, man. That's what it is. Fake outrage, lots of spaces, all that stuff, man. That's what we're trying to do, man. I ain't mad at it, though. Get your money, man. Get your money, man. Do what y'all got to do, man. It is what it is. Um, Because whatever y'all choose to do, it doesn't matter what you think. I think that was the wrong button. It was, we do not care. Hey, we don't. We don't care, man. Do what y'all do. Make your money however you make it. Let me make mine how I make it. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys, speak.